everyone, and welcome to our brand new show, The Dish. I'm Lacey Mazzilli. We're here to show you your favorite players, but in a completely different light. So let's get started. Leading off on the social pitch, let's talk about some of the players' holiday posts. Here's the Sabathia family going all out for Halloween. And you know what? I think they nailed it. On Thanksgiving, Gary Sanchez took to Instagram thanking fans for all of their support throughout the year. And Dellen Patantis, he handed out turkeys in the Bronx. <laughs> During the offseason, the players really have no excuse for not socially updating us on their lives. So here's a recap of it all. Dee Dee relaxes poolside in Florida. Aaron Hicks has been upping his golf game, and it kind of looks like CeCe wants to compete. Luis Severino and Gary Sanchez showed their romantic side when they went on vacations Aww. with their wives. But my personal favorite has to be Sanchez in Peru. Come on guys, look at that view. Now all the guys are back on their workout grind, getting ready for next year. And speaking of, I can't not mention Aroldis Chapman's hashtag Chapman swag. No, seriously guys, it's a thing. Look, it's a thing. We have a very special guest joining us today. The epitome of swag. Mr. Delicious. Oh, and dad, uh, Yankees first baseman, Greg Bird. You guys know him, right? Hi to the both of you. Appreciate you both taking the time, especially you, Mr. Delicious. Tell us, what's the deal with these matching sweaters? Yeah, so I mean, they get cold as a breed, but I thought for Christmas, I'd get us matching sweaters. So Amazon <laughs> came through and here we are with, with two matching reindeer sweaters for me and the cat. <laughs> So now we want to know what's your daily routine looking like and what have you been doing in your time off? Um, I work out four times a week. I mean, that's that's the main stuff. I'll, I'll start baseball activity. Probably after the new year, I'll probably start hitting and throwing and all that stuff. Um, but right now, just working out and um, enjoying my friends and my family. Trying to enjoy the outdoors as much as I can. And, and like I said, just seeing friends and family. Now let's talk about the 2018 season. You said that you're prepping, you're working out. What are your thoughts on the new manager that was just announced for the Yankees, Aaron Boone, and have you met him yet? I mean, I met him a few times, um, starting in spring and just just around, uh, kind of around the, the cage or in, in batting practice. I'm really excited. He seems like a great guy. I mean, I, I think we're looking forward to getting back and, and looking forward to meeting him. It obviously didn't end the way we wanted it to, but it was so much fun. And uh, I mean, I can't wait. All right, Greg, we want to say thank you and you too, Mr. Delicious, for joining us on our very first episode of The Dish. Yeah, thank you guys. Thank you guys. All right, he's out. He's, he's had enough. It's official, guys. The New York Yankees have hired 44-year-old Mr. Aaron Boone as the new skipper. But personally, I have to say, I think everyone overlooked the perfect candidate. She's 5'2", born into a baseball family, lifelong softball player. Yeah, you know who that is. Me, Lacey Mazzilli, moi, this gal. But please excuse my awkward face. I have absolutely no excuse for it. Let's move on. The days may be shorter, but it's still hashtag Tanaka time, as Masahiro Tanaka has decided to not opt out of his contract with the Yanks. Aaron Judge lands the cover of MLB The Show 18, oh, the God. first Yankee to do so, which means if you didn't play before, you should probably play now. The show will be released on March 27th, but I cannot wait that long. It's making me wig out. <laughs> what? <clears throat> oh, I'm sorry. Didn't see you there. Careful, careful. It's my baby. This year's MLB Awards. We have Brett Gardner who snagged the Heart and Hustle Award. What a boy, Gardy. Gary Sanchez and Aaron Judge won their first Silver Slugger Awards yeah. for their beast-like performances this year. And the verdict is in for the judge. Right. And it was unanimous. Aaron earned Rookie of the Year honors. A big New York welcome to powerhouse outfielder Giancarlo Stan. The Yanks acquired the 2017 NL MVP from the Marlins, and everyone is excited. Aaron Judge wants to be besties. Sonny Gray went full Oprah. And Dee Dee asked if he'd still be batting cleanup. Well, one thing's for sure, Ooh. the Yankees lineup will certainly be scary in 2018. With the holiday season in full swing, we here at The Dish want to know how the best fans in the world are celebrating. So using the hashtag MyYankeesHoliday, send us photos of your holiday traditions and how you incorporate the New York Yankees. See, I'm already doing it. And you could be featured in our next episode. And even Masa is doing it as well. The holiday spirit is all around us. Let's see what you got.
All right, guys, that's it for now. Thanks for tuning in for our very first episode of The Dish. I'm Lacey McGilley, and we'll see you all next time. Peace.